Hi guys! A friend of mine recently showed me this gorgeous leather jewelry pouch she had and she wondered if I could make one because it seemed really simple but it was pretty expensive. So I took the challenge and today I'm going to show you guys how easy it is to make these beautiful pouches for just a few dollars. All you're going to need is some vinyl, leather, or suede fabric, ribbon, and fabric scissors or a crocodile. We're going to start by cutting a circle out of our fabric. I'm using this teal vinyl, but you can use any fabric that doesn't fray. I like vinyl because it's easy to find and it's really inexpensive. And we're going to trace a circle on the back using a bowl as our guide. This one's nine inches in diameter, which makes the perfect size pouch. Now we're just going to cut along the line. I'm using a rotary cutter because it's the easiest way to cut circles and leaves a really clean edge, but you can also use fabric scissors. When you're done, remove the excess fabric and ta-da, we have a perfect circle. Now we're going to create our holes for the thread. I'm using my crocodile because it punches a nice clean hole and it's super quick. You can also just use your fabric scissors or an X-Acto knife and make little slits. Continue along the perimeter, placing your holes about an inch apart. The only thing that's important here is to make sure you end up with an even number of holes. Now we're ready to thread our ribbon. I have two pieces that I've cut to 36 inches in length. You'll just want to make sure you have enough to go all the way around the edge of your fabric with a little excess. You're just going to do a simple over under stitch all the way around. And you'll notice I put a piece of tape on the end of the ribbon to make it easier to thread through the holes. When you're finished, your end should hang out on the colored side, and you could just cinch it up and be done here, but I like to add another piece because it makes it open and close a lot easier. So we're gonna take our second ribbon and start threading on the opposite side. You'll wanna make sure you follow the exact same track you did the first time. And now for the fun part, flip it over, pull on all four of your strings until it's about halfway closed, then give it a nice tug. Then I'm gonna trim the ribbon, or you can leave it long to tie in a bow. And ta-da! You have a super chic drawstring pouch that's perfect for protecting your jewelry when you travel or any small items that need safekeeping. These were so easy and inexpensive to create and they make the best handmade gifts. It was so much fun to mix and match different fabrics and ribbon and you could even get more creative and add embellishments. And these are just as much fun for kids as they are mom. <laughs> Uh-oh! Lincoln actually took mine and filled it with some rocks and treasures, and now I can't get it back. Where are all my treasures? In my pouch. What? All my treasures in my pouch. All right, guys, we had so much fun making these pouches. I hope you'll give it a try. Tell me in the comments below what other DIYs you'd like to see, and we'll see you next Friday. Bye, Bye guys! guys.